And uh, Mike Zimmer, head coach of the Minnesota Vikings, joins us now on Verizon Vikings Training Camp Live. Hey, uh, Coach, Paul Allen, Pete Bursage, how you doing? Good, Paul. How's it going? Pretty good, man. Uh, your, uh, your rookie corners, what, uh, what do you think at this stage? Well, they did pretty well today. They, they covered uh, in one-on-one pretty good, and they, did, they made some nice plays in the team period. Uh, Dom Capers, the well-respected Dom Capers, is on your staff. Uh, during this virtual offseason, did he in any way provide you any, like, sneaky blitzes the adversary will never see coming? <laughs> well, we're always talking about blitzes, and, uh, you know, there's always it's always good to get another opinion, somebody else in the room to talk about some of the things they've done in the past or things they saw or things they've studied. And Mike, Mike, the Pete Versich here, I know a lot has changed this year, is all different. Uh, other than doing your press conferences via Zoom, is there anything else that you kind of like about the new way of business here? <laughs> um, here we go. Not, not really. Uh, you know, th- you know the meetings. You'd, I'd prefer to be in the room with them so I can, you know, talk to them, see their face, and things like that. And then, um, uh, you know. Th- I guess other than that, not really. Just I'd rather get back. You know, I'm old school, so what they tell me. <laughs> now, um, uh, Mike, with uh, your pass rush with Neil Hunter and, you know, other spots set to be determined, um, is, is in any way, and this may be the dumbest question you've gotten all year, Hercules Mata'afa, is, is he with that speed and that tenacity and now another year of experience, is, is there a big opportunity there for Hercules Mata'afa? Yeah, Paul, I think there is. Uh, you know, he's put on some weight. He's gotten gotten stronger. I think, you know, he, he needed to do that. He's working real hard. You know, we just have to figure out, uh, you know, what's what's the best combination of guys when we get when we start uh, getting going like we did today. Uh, Mike, couple, one more question on a couple guys. Cameron Dantzler, we, I loved what I saw with him on film. He's a six foot two kid. He may not be as heavy maybe as you want a corner, but what does that length provide him and the lack of a pro day how much did they think that hurt him in the draft process? Yeah, it probably hurt him. You know, he, he didn't run great at the combine, but he had a pro day that he ran pretty well at. And uh, so, but a lot of people didn't get a chance to see him. We liked him a lot on tape. Um, you know, Adam Thielen came up to me during practice today and says 27 is going to be really good. Uh, he's got long arms. He's got good length. So he uses his hands well. And, um, you know, so far he's done a nice job covering Hey, hey, Mike, at this stage of the equation, you know, with the season, the regular season, a month and small change away, I think I think a month from Sunday, um, how frequently do you talk to the veterans about players policing players? And I'm not saying like following people around when they leave here, but just casually reminding people that there's a different way to live this day and age, obviously due to COVID, to make sure we can keep everybody intact. Yeah, um, usually every day they get reminded it's, at some point, uh, you know, it's about being smart, uh, taking care of each other. You know, we don't want to get anybody else's family sick. If you go out and do something, you get their family sick or you get the rest of the team sick. So, um, you know, knock on wood, we've been fairly good so far. And, um, you know, we haven't had any any positive tests per se since we first come back. So our guys are doing a good job with that. They're doing a good job with in the building with the masks and doing a good job uh you know, everywhere else. Time for two more. <laughs> Mike, how's it going with uh, with the defensive staff and, and how Adam Zimmer's working in and Andre Patterson and how you guys are going? Do you have it all do you have it all figured out as how well you're gonna gel or how is you're gonna gel and who's gonna be responsible for what or is that all still a work in progress defensively? Well I think I have a pretty good idea. Um, you know we don't without without the preseason games, you know, usually I don't call many of the preseason games uh, but without the preseason games this year, I'm going to have to get my butt in gear and, and get ready to go during some of these uh, move the ball sessions and things like that where I can go. But, uh, you know, those guys have done a great job. Uh, you know, the thing that I appreciate about them is they don't wait for me to come in the room. They're in there working. And, you know, when I get in there, then 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 we uh, talk about some of the things that I missed and, and where we're at from there. But they've done a great job. Um, they're they're both very, very conscientious guys, and they want to – and they really – they're trying to do whatever they can to please me. Mike, not um, um, you know, with with Justin Jefferson. I mean, there's obviously more of the story to be told, but from a virtual standpoint and what he absorbed to what you're seeing now, uh, what do you think of Justin? Well, Justin Justin's been very very good and uh, throughout. Uh, the OT, well, 
the non-padded practices and, and today he caught a couple balls. Uh, you know, he's he's very, uh, he's got really strong hands, catches the ball really well, um, gets in and out of the breaks very good, uh, dangerous in the open field. Um, you know, right now he's he's really really good in the slot, and uh, you know he moves outside. He's he's still good, but he's got some things to work on out there. But he's doing a great job. If the if the Vikings offense and defense, Mike, had a real game scrimmage for one half right now, who would win and why? Oh, Paul, I don't know. <laughs> it's it's really early. You know, it's yeah. um, <laughs> <laughs> which means the offense is doing really well at this stage, right? Uh, both sides had their days today. Yeah, that's great. Yep. Uh, as are you. Congratulations on the contract extension, and we'll talk soon. Okay, Paul. Thank you. Yeah, Mike Zimmer, Mike Zimmer, head coach of the Minnesota Vikings.